guys what's up it's asif here again do you guys notice the canon eos r5c just released today it will be in our hand in the march of 2022 with a good price point of 4999 dollar this particular camera can work just like the hybrid cameras it can be worked just like the canon eos r5 if you are photographing and it will work as a cinematography camera and shoot 8k up to 60p cinematography and it will have every single thing you're gonna need if you are a pro cinematographer or videographer you can say while shooting the videography but one camera can do that also and that particular camera created for this particular purpose the sony alpha one they call it the Alpha One because this camera can be worked just like the Sony A7S if you are a videographer and can work just like the Sony A7R if you are a landscape and nature photographer can also work just like the Canon sorry, Sony Alpha 9 if you are a wildlife and a sports photographer so that particular camera can also do all the things you gonna need if you are a videographer or a photographer and as i said in my earlier video that if you are a pro photographer you cannot be a pro videographer at the same time and as always if you are a pro videographer then you cannot be a pro photographer at the same time that cannot be possible if only if you are not a god and I'm not I am a normal person so I cannot do all the things at the same time so why is there any need of this level of cameras but we actually have this level of cameras, so I am making a comparison a single comparison between the Canon EOS R5C and the Sony Alpha 1 because they just exist at the same point of time and they actually created for the same purpose so the sony alpha one is standing on a price point of six thousand four hundred and ninety nine dollar and the canon is r5c started at a price point of four thousand nine hundred and ninety nine dollar so this is the only single reason you should have to choose the canon is r5c over the sony alpha one if and only if you want to buy any camera between these two particular one the canon eos r5c and the sony alpha one still i am suggesting you that don't ever never ever buy this particular camera any of these two because they are not good enough for any of your need you can just buy any camera of your preference for photography alone and if you want to be a pro videographer then buy any cinematography oriented camera which don't shoot photos just like this don't fall in the trap again if you just want to buy any of these two camera and have six thousand dollar to west then you can buy the canon eos r5c because it is just having a good value for the money you are getting a canon eos r5 specification inside it and at par of videography it can shoot 8k up to 60p cinematography while the sony alpha one will cost you six thousand four hundred and ninety nine dollar it can work just photography and videography camera as well but the Canon EOS R5C has a greater value for the money. So that's basically all I have to say in this particular video. And I don't want your opinion about the choices between these two particular things because I just don't love any of these two. But I thought that I should make a video between these two because they belong to the same genre. That's why I just created this piece of shit video sorry for that i am saying but that's basically all goodbye guys have a nice day see you on the next video